Hey y'all, it's me, Tyron on the Dragon. It's nice to see you, of course. Go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and share the video. So, let's see what's going on here for the collective. Let's see. So we got behind the scenes of childish. So behind the scenes, somebody doing some childish ass shit. So I be a pity. Yep, guarded. I see you need to guard and protect your energy because this person got a gun. Somebody got a gun. Okay. Romantic thoughts. This person could be having romantic thoughts about you and like they could be in like a really delusional energy. They could be addicted to you somehow. They got some type of addictions here. Yeah. They could be addicted to your energy. What else behind the scenes for the um what's going on? Somebody is submerged in their feelings because you blocked them. Oh my god, I just did this reading. I feel like this has to do with um a reading that's connected here. Somebody's um yeah, somebody's obsessed with you, yo. The reading I just did was about a stripper who um ex-boyfriend was very much uh obsessed with her and was game stalking her, spreading lies and rumors on her and shit. Oh my god. Okay. Toxic family. This could be somebody who you have a family with here that's like obsessed with your energy but yeah i'm gonna put this back because this didn't actually come out if it come out then i'm gonna take it okay so yeah this would be a toxic family yeah okay so this is now coming out obsessed they're obsessed with you this is a toxic family who is obsessed with you they could be addicted to your energy secretly they want you but they, they be a very childish here this could be somebody who you have a family with or this could be like a whole family or group or community of people who are obsessed with your energy it's immersed in their feelings addicted to your energy want to come and talk to you but they know that you're very guarded and protected these people are very childish behind the scenes um they do a lot of drugs and stuff but i feel like this you could be following the signs and the symbols and now you're transforming or these people need to follow the signs and the symbols and transform in either way regardless be grateful because it's coming to an end real soon i'm telling you this is not going to keep up it's not going to last much longer because you're you're following the divine guidance and you're being very uh cautious like you only go when the light is green you don't go in yellow you don't go on red you don't go on purple you don't go on pink it's only when it's green so you you don't move unless you're told to do so you know what i'm saying like these people could be doing spell work over you all types of crazy stuff but um you're protected because you in your life purpose you're doing what you're designed to do so i feel like you're learning something new or very soon here you will be or they're gonna have to learn something new because like i said these people was very codependent upon your energy so they're gonna have to learn something new so somebody could also be um ended up in spiritual jail here but you're in your life purpose so don't even worry about it and also i see you learning something new that is in alignment with your life purpose as well too what else here yeah you could be um getting in alignment with a relationship who you're meant to be with somebody who you're meant to be with somebody who you're meant to be with is coming in here soon and y'all are going to learn something new together these people could be trying to block this um you coming to, into um relate into union with this person um yeah this is your twin here um let's see yeah you also have a new job coming out you got a new job. I see you get a new job. You moving forward. You could be getting a new job. Um, uh -huh. mm -hmm. Actually, you're seeing things from a different perspective. Or people are starting to see you from a different perspective here. I feel like these stubborn people who is holding on to your energy, sending you evil eyes, they're going to have the answer to God. That's not even your problem. That don't got nothing to do with you. This phase will answer you. That has nothing to do with you. That's not your problem. Not nothing. Okay? Missing a piece of the puzzle. They missing a whole lot of pieces to the puzzle. A whole lot of scruples is missing if they think that if at any point this their spell work is going to take you off of your life purpose this is your life purpose this is what you're destined to do so while they doing all that god just waiting for a perfect moment to just hit them back with everything that they're doing because now um you know i see there could be people here who are seeing you from a new view they see you in a different light you're inspiring people in a different way and now somebody could be getting ready to come and apologize to you and possibly come and apologize in the form of money like they want to come and bless you and be like hey baby baby Hey, baby, baby, with your fine ass. They love you, okay? They have sexual fantasies and desires for you, and they want to just come, and they want to just come and bless you with, you know, they just, somebody's desiring you. They want to come and bless you. They want to come and apologize. Could want to apologize, you know, in a sexual way here. They could want to, yeah, they want to celebrate with you. They want to celebrate you and whatever changes here, whatever transformation that you made, because they see you as, um, 
very successful here, very grounded. Yeah, hiding from the true self. Somebody's hiding from their true self. They don't. These people here who still have sin and spell work, doing all this dumb ass shit. They don't. They don't want to accept that you're leveling up. Like this is not gonna work. You've purified your energy enough to the point where it's not gonna work. So now it's like. People are just laughing at them. They think that, you know, they're getting left behind. Yeah. People are laughing at them now because they think that they're doing something, going around still talking bad about you, but really they looking dumb because everybody sees exactly who you are. Like, how the hell can you say that you this? Or how the hell can you say that she's a catfish or something like that? When at the end of the day, you're the one who's codependent on her work. How about it? You the one that's faking. You the one that can't come up with your own motherfucking uh, content. You the one casting all these illusions, sitting up at night, waiting for this performer to drop their content so that you can drop yours because you don't know what the hell to say if that person don't speak. Uh. Shook. Come on now. Yep, and now I see like somebody's about to be, now that people are seeing through the fog, they're about to be arrested and bound by their by their choices. Somebody's about to be in spiritual jail as well. If not spiritual jail, physical jail. I can also see that, yeah, they was jumping to conclusions. Copycats. I hate that. Be original, dog. Now, I mean, it's one thing to be inspired, but to copy word for motherfucking word, what are you doing? Baby. What are you doing, honey? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> You're obsessed, and it's and it's like this person is delusional. At the same point, it's like they're 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 obsessed with your energy. They're stuck in the past. They're trying to expose you for some shit, but they're looking real confused, or they're confused as to why whatever they tried to say about your past isn't sticking, because you ain't the same person. You they're bound they're bound by their choices. What else here? I read the whole deck out. And rumors. They bound by the rumors. Yep. Could you cleanse your space? Or they need to cleanse their space and take a look in the mirror and see what it is that got you still in this energy where you feel like you want to copy people. And you feel like you want to talk bad about people. And you feel like you want to be tricky and say all these lies and stuff. People looking at you like you a goddamn fool. Looking at you like you a goddamn fool. Because at this point, it's like, what are you doing, baby? I don't know who I'm talking to here. I really don't. But you, you, you about to lose whatever. Somebody about to lose some type of position, and they about to be in some type of altercation. Or if they come and try to send altercation towards you, they're gonna be going the wrong way, miserably going the wrong way. Okay. Somebody could have also been trying to send altercation towards your money or finances or something like that. I don't know. Look, like I said, they try to copy you. If you're a reader, they copy your readings. If you're a reader, they don't do shit but stay up and wait until you post your video so that they can post theirs. This person needs help, okay? This person could also be um, pretending to be like a, a, a guide for people just to take fucking money. And now they're about to get, they're about to get up, they're about to, they're about to get, but they about to get it. That's all I can say. Somebody's about to lose their gifts too. That's another thing I see here with this projection here. Projection. So your life is a um is a projection of the energy you're putting out. So if you're putting out copycat energy and you're ciphering other people's energy, you stealing people's energy, you're about to lose your you're about to lose your own gifts. And somebody's sending evil eye because you continue to grow and they're getting kicked out, left behind. And they're shook. Because whatever blackmail somebody tried to do, it, they manifested it into their own lives to the point where they have to now make choices to copy other people because they cannot, they can't, they can't do it. They can't do shit. They're stuck in the past. You're stuck in the past. You can't be, you can't be me. Like, what do you mean? This shit is weird. Shit. That's what I feel like you are saying to this person. You can't be me. What are you doing, dog? Find you something to do other than try to wait and watch for my shit. What are you? What the fuck? Like, come on, bro. I feel like this is coming. This is coming to light, though. Let's see. What's the? I want to see what other cards will come out. This is about to come. Yeah, just relax. Just relax, baby. Anything else out of these little five cards? <laughs> Anything?
everything else. <laughs> you get a new cycle here. Self-reflect, okay? This person needs to self-reflect and stop lying about them getting money and how they're getting money. This person spending money to do black magic on you. This person ain't got no money. They're doing black magic over your money. They, you have upgraded. You're going to keep upgrading. You also got more money coming in here, flowing in as an upgrade. So, yeah, somebody somebody's getting caught up because they was doing way too much. Purify your energy because they was doing too much, okay? They they trying to do all this extra shit. I'm t I promise you ain't none of it going to stick. Because when you're in your life purpose, can't nobody come and take you off of your life purpose. As my G got the T said, God hired me. Who going to fire me? <laughs> this person here was not hired. <laughs> this person came and tried to steal somebody else's position. But it does, they you can't be Cinderella. The, the shoe only fit on Cinderella's foot. You can't do that. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know who that message is out here for. But, um, yeah, as always, go ahead and type in the comments whether this message resonated or not. I am victorious and know that you always will be. I am victorious. And subscribe oh and you can donate to my channel by following the information inside of my bio later